Hello, I was asked to explain how uh, dwell flash works on a uh, Sun distributor machine. Uh, the dwell flash is this little module. This replaces the uh, neon strobe tube with uh, a high power LED and uh, this is the entire power supply for it. It's all low voltage, safe to touch. And one of the advantages of this is that uh, there's a little switch that goes with it and when that switch is flipped, it goes from normal to dwell flash. So if you had normally eight arrows going on the uh, dial, now you'd have 16. And what it does is normally you, you would only see when the points open, you'll have a flash. And in, in dwell flash, you get a flash not only when the points open, but when they close again. So uh, my machine is a thousand miles away, so I have to do it with a little diagram here. If you're going uh, counterclockwise, or in some parts of the world they call it anti-solar, uh, eight-cylinder engine, the maximum dwell is uh, normally 45. So the rotation is this way, and you'll read the dwell going in the opposite direction. Now. When initially you set up in normal, you'll have the flashes. There's a movable ring, and what you do is you place that movable ring so uh, the zero is at one of the flashes. And then you flip on the uh, dwell flash, and you'll get twice as many arrows. You just have to remember that when you are reading dwell and it's going counterclockwise, you read the dwell in the opposite direction. So uh, a normal dwell is around two-thirds of uh, the maximum dwell. And uh, so that makes it about, you know, between 30 and 35 uh, degrees usually. And so you'll see uh, one of these arrows somewhere in that range. Another way to tell is it, you know, usually because it's two-thirds, and if you're any kind of a mechanic, you've set up the points halfway decent, it's the wider section. So if you me measure any uh, reading between the two widest arrows, uh, that'll give you the dwell. And again, when you go clockwise, uh, you put it in normal, and you'll have uh, a flash, and you'll set the scale to zero again. But this time, we read counterclockwise and so from that one flash again you go down the scale and you'll see that 33 35 36 whatever the points are set at so it's it's as simple as that you know either look for the widest section or the simple way to remember it is whatever direction the uh, distributor is turning you'll read the dwell on the uh, opposite direction and uh, you know you set it up normal uh, you can tell easily whether in normal or dwell flash because dwell flash has twice as many flashes it flashes when the points open up which would be normal and also flashes when the points close again it's very convenient and uh, you can see every lobe of the uh, of the distributor going around the whole side so it's, it's not just you know one little corner of it it's the whole thing you'll get all these flashes so that's it thanks for watching